Good day, YouTube. I went to a memorial service a few days ago and I heard some words that caught my attention. The title of this video, How to Stand on the Earth. And what does that mean to me? That's what I want to talk about. Never heard about that before, but that's what this means. I think about it often. I have conversations with people often and I tell them life is sweet. I'm not saying it's easy, but life is really sweet and it's what we make of it, our outlook, how we react to things in life. To me, how to stand on the earth means this. It's that satisfaction with your day from beginning to end. And it doesn't mean it has to be satisfaction throughout the entire day. There's things that are going to happen that happen to us. Life happens. It's satisfaction with your job. More importantly, with who you are as an individual, or where you are in life, where you're headed, and how you're going to make that happen. Whether it's your job or college or high school, whatever status you may be, it's that satisfaction where you enjoy a Monday, a Tuesday, a Wednesday, and Thursday, and a Friday just as much as you enjoy the weekends. I've heard the saying, live for the weekends, and, and if that's all we live in is just for Saturday and Sunday, my thought is that we're not living the way we should because there's seven days in a week, not just two. So hopefully we are having fun, satisfaction, enjoying the moment seven days a week. And like I said just a moment ago, life does happen. Let me give you an example. Yesterday I got pulled over. I was with my wife and uh, I got pulled over. As for my ID, the officer, police officer said I took a light when I turned and it was red and she was right. It was, it was red. I can't say anything about that. The last time I got a, a ticket was in 1994, 24 years ago. And guess what? I got a ticket yesterday, $170, but I don't like excuses. So first of all, I knew I was in the wrong. I took it and that was my decision. So I have to live with that consequence. It was a moment where for about 10 minutes later, I was thinking about it and then I had to let that go. And instead of being upset about it, here's my outlook is, you know what? It keeps me grounded. So the next time I have to make a decision driving, I should make the right decision. If not, I'm gonna pay the consequences, $170. Standing on the earth is this, is having that support system that is either family and or friends that are there for you, that you enjoy to hang out with, that you can just enjoy simple things when you're not traveling. Simple things like the, the weekend, the day, the Monday through Friday. Standing on the earth is, is doing positive things with your lives. Not gossiping, not talking behind someone's back, not being jealous about someone's life, especially with social media. You get to see what people post. And, and, and we should celebrate what they're doing, their moments, their victories, and not think that the grass is greener over there or, or how is it that they get to do this or get to do that and we don't. Standing on the earth is not just getting by, but maximizing opportunities when opportunities are there, seeking out opportunities and, and making the most, having a vision and working hard to make that happen. Standing on the earth is what we make of it. First of all, we have to have that awareness. We have to count our blessings, whether it's health, whether it's doing what we want to do in life, whether it's that job satisfaction, is being thankful for, for the opportunities that we get to mentor others as others mentor us. Standing on the earth can mean a lot of different things. To me, I'm just going off the top of my head with what I'm thinking right now. And it actually means a lot more as well. I can come up with more things, but this video would be five hours long and that's not gonna happen. So think about it. What does it mean to you? Think about it for a moment and then come up with something that's gonna make your life, your moment, your day, your Monday through Friday as satisfying as the weekend. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Take care.